In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to build a fully functional Shopify store in just a few clicks using a powerful AI tool called Atlas. I'll be showing you each step with real tools, real content, and a real product, so you'll see exactly how it all works. Whether you're new to Shopify or just looking for a faster way to build stores, you're going to want to stick around for this. Alright, before we dive into building the store, the first thing we need to do is sign up for Shopify. To make things easy, and to support the channel, just head over to ecomsensei.com slash Shopify. This is my affiliate link, and it gives you a special offer, a free trial, plus your first three months of Shopify for just $1 a month. Once you're on that page, enter your email, click Start Free Trial, and follow the steps to set up your store. Shopify will ask a few basic questions about your business. Just answer what you can, and then it'll drop you right into your dashboard. Next up, we need to install the Atlas AI Store Builder. From your Shopify dashboard, look to the left and click on Apps, then hit the Add Apps button. Now, here's a heads up. Atlas might not show up right away on the suggested apps list. That's totally normal. Just scroll down and click on the Shopify App Store link at the bottom. That'll take you to the official Shopify App Store. In the search bar at the top, type in Atlas. The first result you'll see should say Atlas AI Store Builder. Click on it, then hit the Install button. You'll be redirected back to your Shopify dashboard. Once you're there, click Install again to confirm the app. Once you've installed the Atlas app, you'll land back on your Shopify dashboard. Before we start setting things up, it's a good idea to pin the app so it's easier to find later. Just click the pin icon next to the Atlas app. This keeps it right there on the left-hand menu for quick access anytime. Now, go ahead and click on Start Setup. Atlas will guide you through a few quick setup questions. Just answer them based on what you're building. When you get to the final question, it'll ask, do you have a product link already? If you already have a product link from AliExpress, Amazon, or somewhere else, choose yes and just follow the steps from there. But in this case, let's say you don't have one yet. Go ahead and select no. That'll take you straight into the main Atlas dashboard. Now you'll see a few different product source options. AliExpress, Amazon, Alibaba, or products from your own Shopify store. For this example, I'm going to go with Amazon. So now, in a new tab, head over to Amazon.com and find a product you want to build a store around. Once you've picked one, just copy the link from your browser. Then go back to the Atlas app page inside Shopify and paste that Amazon product link into the field provided. You can also choose your store language here. I'll just leave it as English for now. Once you hit Generate Store, Atlas starts working right away. It grabs all the product details directly from the link you provided, including the images, product title, description, pricing, and more. At this stage, Atlas will display the product photos it pulled in. You can choose which ones you want to include in your store or upload your own if you've got better quality images. Once that's done, you'll move into customizing your store. You can change your store's color theme, tweak your product info like the name and price, adjust the customer reviews, edit the FAQ section, and even make changes to the homepage layout. Just click on each section and start editing from there. Everything's laid out super intuitively. You'll be able to see a live preview of your product page. It includes pricing, customer reviews, estimated shipping times, and product highlights, all written in a natural, friendly tone that actually sounds human. Once you've gone through and made the changes you want, click Continue. Now it's time to choose your plan. But before selecting one, make sure to enter the coupon code ECOMSENSEI. That'll unlock a discount on whatever plan you decide to go with. So don't skip that step. Once that's applied, you'll see the discounted available plans. I personally recommend the Pro plan since it gives you access to both the product bundler and the AI product photo tools. When you're ready, just click Start your 7-day free trial, add your credit card or PayPal details, then hit Approve to confirm it. 
After you've subscribed and confirmed your plan, Atlas will finish building your store and automatically connect everything to Shopify. You'll see a pop-up saying Import Successful, and from there, you can click View Your Store to check it out. You'll see a new theme called Atlas Theme in your theme library. To start editing your store, click Publish. To set it as your active theme, then hit Customize to begin making adjustments inside Shopify's theme editor. Now that the Atlas theme is live, let's make sure it looks right. Go to the top right and switch to Mobile View, since most people will be browsing from their phones. If your store doesn't look quite right, don't panic. Just go to App Embeds on the left menu and make sure the Atlas toggle is switched on. This fixes the layout and activates all the design features Atlas built into your theme. From here, you can change homepage banners, update product images, rearrange sections, and make sure the store flows nicely from top to bottom. Always save your progress before exiting. The default photos from Amazon are okay, but they often look generic or inconsistent. That's where Atlas's AI product photo tool comes in. Back in your Shopify dashboard, Click on AI Product Photos under the Atlas app. Click on Start Creating Now, and you'll be shown a few training guidelines. Make sure to read through them. They're important if you want the best results. Once you're ready, give your model a name. Then either select existing product photos from your Shopify store, or upload new ones right here. After that, you'll choose a training speed. The 30-minute option is fine for most cases, but if you want sharper, more detailed results, the three-hour training gives noticeably better output. Once your model is finished training, you'll see the status update to succeeded, just like it shows on my screen here. To start creating your AI-generated product photos, go over to the right side and click on the Actions button. This will bring up the prompt editor. This is where you tell the AI exactly what kind of product photo you want. Now, you can write the prompt completely from scratch if you want, but I highly recommend using the Use AI Suggested Prompt button at the top. Once you click the button, it'll automatically fill in a detailed prompt for you. This prompt includes everything the AI needs, like your product's design, color, background style, lighting, and even the setting or vibe of the image. If you want to tweak anything, you can just highlight and edit the text manually. I'm happy with how mine looks, so I'll go ahead and scroll down and click Generate Now, then confirm it. And now, we'll see the product photos start generating down at the bottom of the screen. And just like that, the AI-generated product photos are ready. I'm pretty happy with the results here, so I'll pick a couple of my favorites. To save the ones you want to use, just select the images, then click Save Selected Images. Once they're saved, Head over to the Saved Images tab. You'll see all the photos you just saved appear there at the bottom. Go ahead and select the ones you'd like to download and hit Download Selected. That'll save the images to your computer so you can add them to your Shopify store. Next, on the left-hand side, click on Products, then select the product we've been working on. Scroll down to the Media section, click the plus icon, then choose Add Media. From here, upload the AI photos you just saved. I'll upload the images I picked earlier, then click Done once they're in. You can repeat this whole process as many times as you want to create more product photos. And this will help give your store a full, polished gallery that looks clean, cohesive, and professional. Another great way to increase your average order value and make your store more profitable is to set up a product bundle. Head over to Bundle Deals under Atlas on the left. Click Create Bundle to get started. Atlas gives you four bundle templates to pick from, each designed to boost sales in a different way. There's Buy X Get Y, like Buy Two, Get One Free, perfect for quick promos. Volume Discount offers better deals the more someone buys, like 10% off for two, 30% off for five. Complete the Look lets you bundle related items like an outfit at a discount. And Special Bundle plus Free Gift adds a free item at higher tiers to encourage bigger orders. Pick the one that fits your product strategy best, then customize from there. Give your bundle a name, then fill in your bundle title, 
update the Add to Cart button text, and choose which products the bundle applies to. You can target all products, a specific collection, or just one item. You can also tweak how the pricing appears and adjust display settings like variant images and layout spacing. If you want to edit any of the offers, just click into them. You'll be able to change the text, labels, and the discount type, like setting a percentage off, fixed amount, or even a buy one get one deal. Once you're happy with everything, click the colors, text tab to match your bundle's look to your store, then hit publish. You'll get a success message, but to actually show the bundle on your store, click take me to my store and hit customize on the Atlas theme. Scroll down your product page. If you don't see the bundle yet, click the plus icon, go to the apps tab and add the Atlas bundler block. Once it's added, click save in the top right. And now your product bundle is live and ready to help drive more sales. If you're planning to sell more than just one product, adding multiple products to the same store is actually really simple. Just head to product pages under Atlas on the left side. You'll see the theme we already created earlier. Select that, then click Generate Product Page. From here, it works just like before. Choose where your product is coming from, paste in the link, and Atlas will generate a brand new product page for you. This way, you can keep building out your store with more products, all under one clean, professional storefront. Before we wrap up, let's quickly go over Shopify's pricing plan so you know what to expect after the trial. First, there's the basic plan starting at $19 a month when billed yearly. It's great for solo entrepreneurs. You get 10 inventory locations, 24 7 chat support, and in-person selling tools. Third-party card rates start at 2%, and you can try it for just $1 a month for the first three months. Next is the Grow Plan at $49 a month. It's ideal for small teams and includes five extra staff accounts, the same inventory and support, and lowers your card fees to 1%. Then we have the advanced plan, starting at $299 a month. This one's for scaling businesses. You get 15 staff accounts, local storefront support, and even lower payment fees, down to 0.6%. And finally, there's Shopify Plus at $2,300 a month, built for large, complex businesses with custom needs. No need to decide right away, you can explore all of this risk-free with the three-month trial at ecomsensei.com slash Shopify. And there you have it. In just a few simple steps, you've built a fully customized, professional Shopify store, complete with clean product photos, compelling content, and smart bundle offers, all powered by AI. Now, the next step is traffic, getting people to actually find your store and start buying. So I've put together a follow-up video that walks you through how to get free traffic to your Shopify store. It's a great next step if you're just getting started and want to avoid spending on ads. I'll leave that link in the description. Be sure to check it out right after this. Thanks for watching and good luck with your store.